Welcome to Goodwe Training Series. Today we will take you through the ESA Series Storage System installation. Firstly, make sure all breaker is turned off. Step 1. Mounting Wall Plate. You should mount the wall plate 1206mm from floor. Ensure the surface can hold the weight of entire system of 50 kilograms. Use appropriate fasteners to secure the Goodwe Smart Hybrid Inverter mounting plate to the mounting surface. The top of the mounting plate can be identified by the word top stamped into the frame. Step 2. Placing Battery Enclosure. Screw the two feet to the base of the battery enclosure, using the three screws provided. Place the battery enclosure with cover removed under the wall plate. Use the supplied fixing screw and plug set to fix the enclosure onto the wall. Step 3. Mounting the balance of system. Carefully remove the boss cover from the compartment. Lift the boss and place it on the two mounting hooks. Ensure that both hooks are engaged before releasing the boss. Install the screw at both sides of boss, fix it on the wall plate. Step 4. Mounting the inverter. Lift the inverter and place it on the boss in a way that the male and female connectors are engaged and locked. Screw the top side of the inverter to the mounting plate with the screws provided. Step 5. Boss wiring. Screw the antenna into the connector on the left side of the inverter. Connect protective earth wire into earth terminals. Maximum conductor size for PE cable is 16 square millimeter. Connect backup and on-grid wiring to the bottom of backup breaker and utility breaker, respectively. Connect each group of battery power cable to boss battery bank connector. Connect solar array wire. Crimp the power cable with conductor core section of 4 square millimeter. Please use the Amphenol MC4 connectors in the accessory bag. Connect meter communication cable and BMS cable RJ45 from top of boss to bottom of inverter. Connect Goodwe Smart Meter Communication Cable and BMS Cable RJ45 from bottom of boss to meter and battery, respectively. Step 6. Mounting the Energy Meter and CT Sensor. First, connect the AC cable to the AC input. We suggest you install an external 0.5 amp fuses on each phase. Second, clip each of them to the corresponding AC cable shown on the screen. Please make sure the position is between the loads and the grid and the CT direction is housed to grid. Please be aware that incorrect connection or direction will cause wrong meter data. Next, connect the communication cable between the inverter and the smart meter. Connect the end to the communication port on the smart meter. Step 7. Inserting the batteries. Insert the batteries onto the shelves one at a time by inserting the battery pack bottom first into the cabinet. Please fill the cabinet from bottom to top. Insert battery 2 first then 1. Once the batteries are placed into position, plug the respective power leads into the power connectors on the batteries while taking note of the polarity. Install the two stents of battery enclosure. Step 8. BMS Connection. Connect the inverter BMS cable to first battery BMS port. Connect first battery BMS cable to second battery. The dip switches shall be configured differently between single-piece battery and two batteries paralleling system. Step 9. Install all covers. Install the cover of boss and battery enclosure. Finally you can turn on the breaker to start the ESA system. That's all for ESA installation. Thank you for watching. For more installation and configuration videos of Goodwe training series, please visit our Goodwe community and stay tuned to our official account.